stolen car which she never told anybody about until we got pulled by the old mill. <laughs> Did you know this car was stolen? No, no, no. <laughs> yeah, that's the one. He's coming back tonight and we're all asleep in the car and he goes, come on boys, you're coming down the station. That's what for. And he goes, the car's nicked. An old pair for a change the number plate slider, not the told us not, you know. But they kept us in there all night to let us go. But they, <coughs> it was decent though, because like the old pants didn't need to you know, they had nothing to do with it and all that. Because we didn't know, you know. He only had me in the court with that, is he? No, he's still a man, isn't he? Come up to the dinner now, I bet. Do you want to sort of stay in the middle? Don't you? Know, don't have a car to force around. It's too long ago. Wardle Street's up there, right? Uh, we'll see if we get a place up Wardle Street. Uh, I, I used to have a... You can park up there quite easily, just past the marquee in a bit. There's plenty of places up there. Yeah. 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 What, is Granny married? Is Granny married? Who? Yeah, I don't know. She's still living with old fucking spastic Jack, though, isn't she? I want to beat him up, you know, I see. Fuck you, Come on, mate. See job, never had a car, you left school but you didn't get that far, always on the dull, never had work, cheers Maggie, I feel a jerk. One of Maggie's millions, the national debt gets more, she must be forking out billions to carry on feeding the poor. You can meet us all over the place, saying the country's a big disgrace, 
What we need is another war. Let off the atom bomb, kill the poor. Get me a job, get me a car, buy me a lie where I put a bar. All I want is a normal life, free of debts and worry and strife. Peace, war is hazardous to your health. There are no winners in a war, everyone loses something. Yeah, right. Graffiti massage. Most skinheads stick together, you know what I mean? It's something to identify with. And that's why a lot of people don't like skinheads, because they're frightened, because they realise that they are a force, you know what I mean? That they all stick together. Jeans. So if I just put a bit of bleach in there, I'd go white again, wouldn't I? <laughs> yeah, right. right I'm, just putting, I'm just putting my jeans in with this stuff, all right? And then he's putting all his whites in with mine, all his white socks and T-shirts. Oh, I won't find the bleach. I can't wear mine anymore. Wear what? My bleach is too. Why not? Too short, mate. Ellie works, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. I'd say it's like music first, and then girls, you know what I mean? Uh, like, you know, football and all that, you know, going out of your mates and all that. Violence just doesn't really come into it, you know, it's just, nobody talks about it. The papers pull out the violence being too much, you know what I mean? It's a nice t-shirt, isn't it? We're both adopted, like me and my brother. Because, like, she was only 16, and, like, 1959, it weren't on a thing like I'm married mother of 16. So, like, she ran away to Brighton, and I was born, and uh, I was uh, put up for adoption. And uh, in those days, right, uh, my, my dad had been, uh, he'd been working in Edinburgh University with x-rays. And the doctor told them that, you know, better be careful not to have children in case they were deformed. So, like, they adopted me and then they adopted my brother. So, um, he, he just comes around and, you know, slags off my mum whenever he comes around, you know, shouts at her and all that. Because he's learned all these new words at college or whatever, you know, he thinks he's really big. He, used to, he, he, went, he went to Charterhouse. I went to a good school, got expelled though. I went to Safer College. I hated it. Going down, lad, and my brother kept going up. Everything I did was worse, and he always kept doing better things. It was sort of like split. I went one way, he went another way. I'm the black sheep of the family, but I'm the most loved. Sort of thing, you know what I mean? Oi, is that all I'll get for 10p? I'll <laughs> bang it. You bang it, your 10p's gone through. Yeah, we'll put it under and bang it well. Oh, it's empty. Fuck. Fill it up. Right. Can you fill it up? Yeah, we've got time to now. You have to go and buy a now. <laughs> <laughs> um, when I was at this public school, you know, I, the, the way they teach you, that they teach you is that you're never going to be on the dole. You're never going to be poor, you know what I mean? They teach you so that when you leave school, you've got this... You feel... You, you, you look down on everybody, you know what I mean? I mean, like, my, my brother goes around calling people plebs and working class and all that, which is really pathetic, you know. That's how he's brought up, you know, it's really... It makes me sick. I laugh at him, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, I see the head boy that was at the school. Oh, I beat him up. Look, Go and get some powder, will you? 